Welcome back to Virtual Reality. My name is Thomas and you are watching Voodoo DEVR. Today we will play The Walking Dead Saints and Sinners, this time on the PlayStation VR. I already showed that on PC, but this time we will play it on the PlayStation. And this is a zombie game, a very brutal zombie game where we have to solve quests, have a good story and um, different items to collect, different um, quests. That's very awesome. Um, this time the video is sponsored by Skydance Interactive. Thank you so much for this. But uh, of course this doesn't have any influence on my opinion uh, of the game as always. So um, if you want to download the game you can find the link in the description below. You can find everything about VR and AR on this channel. Also of course thank you to my regular Patreon sponsors Woodgoes VR, Oppermann Events, Andy Defelser VR Ambassador and Alpha Blend Interactive. Let's have some fun with the video and let's go! Okay guys, welcome to the game. I played around 20 or 25 minutes on my German channel and now we have to um, solve our mission. So uh, for me it's very interesting to uh, compare the PlayStation VR version to the PC version that I already showed and uh, what I can tell you is that um, the, the loading times are very very long to be honest. That's a little bit disturbing that uh, yeah, for people that are not so patient like me it's a little bit bad. We have very long loading times. Um, the next thing is that the graphics are looking not as good as on PC. So the textures are a little bit muddy sometimes here, um, but that's normal. I mean, we have the PlayStation. Um, I have the PlayStation 4 Pro and it's normal that it doesn't have the same. However, the, the controls with the move controller are pretty good to be honest. I mean of course when we turn around now, when I turn around, um, then the tracking is gone from the controllers. That's normal thing. We can reset it with the options uh, stuff. And uh, what's, what the heck is that? Um, however, we can just grab our weapons here. We can, we can shoot them here. Um, we can put them back. Um, we can use the flashlight. We can use stuff from uh, uh, from from the back, like our backpack here, we have a knife. Um, then we have our note, notes here. Sorry for the German version. It says take the boat uh, to the Undeep and um, search for a microphone in the blue villa. And that's what we're gonna do now. Can turn around here a little bit. Um, yeah, let's, oh, how can I, um, how can I choose that? Oh, here. Oh, let's, go. let's go there. That's where we have to go. Um, so now perhaps we can see the, the loading time. So when you start the game from the PlayStation menu, it takes a minute or something. And then always when we go somewhere, we see this uh, loading screen. But I mean, yeah, this is nothing um, where I would say this game is bad or something. It's just a little bit annoying to wait all the time so long. It's fine, it's fine. So yeah, here we are, here's our boat and now we can um, even check out the map here. So. There's the blue villa and we have to go around here. We will do that. If we double click the move button, we, we can run. Please. There is a side quest, your help. but uh, let's just not do that for now. I think there's even some more fog, more than in the PC version, just to uh, make sure there's more performance. We cannot see objects in the background here. Um, let me just uh, show you some options here. Uh, sorry, it's, it's German here, but uh, we can uh, reduce the vignette here if we like. And, um, oh, we can 
deactivate all vignettes here, um, choose which hand we want to use, um, some other stuff here, uh, like the how the wing, the, the, the grip buttons, and here we see the um, button alignment, we can um, choose the smart turn, a smooth turn, we can choose audio, some stuff for the HUD. And now if you turn around there is no vignette anymore. Please note that we have to um, walk very slow when we don't want to um, attract attention from the zombies, so we have to kill very um, uh, silent here and we have to uh, check out that the um, weapons do not break so we have uh, some um, information here stability sharpness and throw so yes we, we should go here Voodoo Cola! Ha! Look at this. They stole my name. <laughs> um, where, where was the blue villa? I think we can, we can check this. Oh yeah, we are here. Are you coming for me? Yeah! It just feels great. The game feels great, but I already told that to you when I played it on PC. It's, it's just awesome. Of course, yeah, when you have the Valve Index, you have a wider field of view, uh, better tracking, you can turn around and stuff. Uh, yeah, it's of course more immersive, but even on the PlayStation, it's, it's just a good game. You know that already. Hello, my friend. Uh-oh. <laughs> That was close. Uh, we can climb up there, but let's let's get here. Check out if we have some stuff here. No, I I I can see that there is more fog and more muddy textures, definitely than with the PC version. That's just true. Oh, that was. That's ammunition, right? Yeah, that's that's what we really, really need. What the heck? No, we don't need the earphones here. Hello? Hmm. No, uh, we don't need that. We have to climb there. Let's do that. Here we are. Is that also ammunition? Yeah, that's right. Um, on the right move button, we can crouch. Very important. Hello. There's my real wall. <laughs> God. Who are you? She's dead, I think. Yeah? So, we need a key. We need a key. Oh, shh. <sighs> Thanks. What? Oh. that the key or what? Oh, that's what we need! Do we have it? Yes! We got it! That's it! So, uh, the What sound is that? Um, what we 
normally need is oh shit is the uh, key for the door um, because we uh, need the side quest but uh, um, no we don't need the side quest we can do that if we want but uh, it's not necessary if you want to see that you can check out my PC review um, yeah, let's go and we can enter the house here as well that's good so there are definitely different ways and that's a good thing I love that <clears throat> so now we can go back if we like let's use the, the weapon now the gun now we have to be very fast because everybody can hear us right Oh, that's where we came from, so let's go back here. We cannot run unlimited. You perhaps see the um, little slider here that shows our lung. And the green is our health. Oh, shit. Headshot! Thank you. So normally we should be as um, quiet as possible. But it's the... Can we shoot this? Awesome. So there's a side quest. Over we here. can also go for a side quest, but... And then we can go back to the cemetery. Yeah, guys, that's very interesting um, to see this game on PlayStation VR. Now you can't see the. What, what do you see while I'm. Oh, the same. Yeah, you, you can see the same. That's good. Um, while I see it as well. Um, yeah, loading times are too long, but I think there's no way to change that. You just have to stand that. <laughs> That's true. Um, I will just show you uh, a little bit of the handling of the of the bus now where we can um, change items to materials do you see that it's very long it's very long and there are a lot of loading times here we go So where was that here, right? Yeah, there's there's the bus, and now we can finish the mission because we found this um, piece of the microphone. That means that we have to get a backpack, and then um, where the heck was that here? What the? Oh, where's? That was my fault. Sorry for that. Yeah! Awesome! Hello? What was that again? Channel 61. Oh! Is 
So uh, now we have to push the X button and then say, oh wait, waterfall. waterfall. And that's the code word. And now what you just they are talking, but I will not show that to you again. Uh, we can recycle stuff and then we get it here and we have all the stuff here it, I mean it's uh, German now but we can find all the stuff here and we can use it to craft stuff this alcohol when we drink it we can sleep don't use alcohol at what home what did to you sleep. just say? <laughs> I and need a second okay I'll be here and here we can choose stuff um, to craft but um, we don't have all the ingredients here. We need water, protein, ballast, uh, and um, uh, spice. Here we can also craft new stuff. We Sometimes we have to unlock that. Here we have a knife. So we need some glue and some uh, wood, I think. So, yeah, we. this is our uh, cam, I would say. Really really awesome yeah guys so that what was what i wanted you to show how the game works on the playstation vr it's really really good you know that and uh, but let's go back to the studio and talk about it okay guys the walking dead saints and sinners so i played it on the pc already but i can totally confirm that it's also awesome on the PlayStation VR. It's one of the best virtual reality games. That is fact. You know that. And um, of course the three things, I mean the graphics, the tracking of the move controllers when you hold it behind your back and the loading times. But oh my, my god, just buy it. It's it's totally worth it. You can see it has five from five stars. Everybody loves the game and it's really fun even on the PlayStation VR. Um, the price is okay, it's 40 bucks. That's normal for a PlayStation VR game. It's totally worth it. So guys, if you liked the video, <coughs> sorry, give me a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel and see you next time in virtual reality. See ya.